Hey, it's Randy, here in the garage. What I've got in the work stand today is this uh, old mountain bike frame, I'm guessing from the late 80s, early 90s. Um, it's a uh, guess made by Huffy. The down tube says Sonoma. So I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with it other than build it up. So if you'd like to follow along and uh, I think instead of uh, giving you a play-by-play, -play, we'll just wait till it's finished and then I'll go over what it is. to this thing um, as I've been building it and I'm not sure what I got on video and what I didn't. So um, I'll just wait till it's all put together and we take it out for a ride and I'll explain everything I did and read it. <laughs> So far, so good. Rides nice. Everything seems to function. Seems to fit me pretty good. 
I'll pull over here in a minute and we'll, uh, we'll go over what all it's made of. I started with just the frame that I picked up recently at a, a bike shop a closing auction and it's branded Tektra Sports and then below that it says by Huffy and the model is a Sonoma it says the main tubes are uh, chromoly. The fork, I assume, is just a cheap, straight steel fork, judging by uh, mostly by these dropouts. And as you've seen, it was blue, and I gave it a coat of this kind of cream-colored paint to match this. As for the wheel set, I've got a mismatched wheel set. I don't know what either of these wheels are. Uh, the front one's got a pretty cool hub, though. This back one's the painted black but the initial wheel set I was going to use had a six-speed freewheel and I thought I'd upgrade that to a seven speed but I could not get the freewheel off so I uh, opted just to switch to a different wheel set this one has a eight-speed cassette I'm not sure of the the range there and I replaced the triple crank set that uh, came with the frame to make it a one by uh, originate crank arms and um, just a no-name uh, narrow wide chain ring 38 tooth and these plastic platform pedals Sun Tour XCE rear derailleur that's shifted by this uh, friction thumb shifter so it's really limited on the stem and handlebar setup as um, this had a really narrow steer tube and uh, even uh, too narrow for a quill stem adapter. So I just had to use one of these old uh, goosenecks. Both the uh, stem and handlebars are probably walled, uh, both steel and were originally chrome painted the stem black had another set of these handlebars that I uh, painted in an aluminum color but decided uh, I think I like black better so I painted this uh, this handlebar black and swapped them out the grips are Pedro's uh, black walls so these Diacomp uh, cantilever brakes front and rear as you've seen, though, I initially put on a V-brakes on the back because I didn't know I had the matching set to the front, but I found them on another frame that I had stashed away. Brake levers are just some cheap brake levers off Amazon. Tires are these Schwalbe Billy Bonkers. I didn't have a seat post that was the right size, so I ended up using a shim to get this one to fit. A Brooks B-17 saddle. And I think that about covers it. And as always, thanks for following along.